Hey guys, it's Arrow. Here is my overview video of Maxine the Mule. I finished, well, depending on when you're watching this, um, I finished this up last night, but Tom had to go to bed for work early in the morning. So, um, I wasn't able to do final photos and I wanted to wait to do my overview video until the morning because all of this lovely green fur is actually UV reactive. It's the new UV reactive like green apple fur or something from How Fabric. Um, I love it. I can't wait to see it underneath the black light tonight, which I will be um, doing at least one of the photos with the black light. So, starting off with the tail here. And then my first mittens ever, which these are actually incredibly comfortable. And I also decided to give you um, beaver fur for the black instead of shaving black. It is so incredibly soft. Um, I almost want these for mine. <laughs> and I will definitely be making more in the future as far as pre-mades and stuff. Um, here's the head. I think I did a pretty good job. Di di wow. Diff differentiating? Differentiating. That word. Whatever. It's different than my horses I have made because it's a meal and their um, muzzle shapes and their ear shapes are slightly different. So, yeah. There's a little heart on there. And then ears come to a point. Unlike with my zebra I made last December, I decided to use foam for the core of the hair instead of just stuffing it. And, I mean, I honestly think it turned out really, really good. Um compared to the main for my zebra last year. And then last but not least, my tongue is Velcro, which I haven't gotten to do Velcro in a really long time. And I, if you know me at all, you know I hate working with magnets, so. <sighs> anyway, there we go. There's my overview video of Maxine.